It's homecoming week, Linmar. We're bringing you the latest on all the events happening across the campus. Linmar, your news starts now. Hey, Linmar! It's Wednesday, October 9th, 2019. It's stress as your favorite decade day. Did you wear clothes from your favorite decade? Remember, tomorrow's Trendy Thursday. Come dressed as your favorite online trend. Our top story, this is homecoming election day. We needed someone very dignified and very honest to tell us this story. LMTV's Aber Sam Lincoln has the story. Thanks, guys. Today is the official election day for the 2019 homecoming king and queen. Anyone in grades 10 through 12 is eligible to vote. There is only one vote per student. Voting is open until 3.30 p.m. today. Handouts will be available around the building and the results will be announced at the coronation ceremony following the parade Thursday night. And remember, be honest, Linmar. Guys, back to you. Thanks, Saber Sam Lincoln. In other homecoming news, the dance is this Saturday from 8 to 10.30 in the main gym. Admission is $8 for a single person and $15 per couple. You must show a photo ID to get in. Reed Photography will be there starting at 5. Get your pictures taken early and avoid the crowds. Speaking of homecoming, you must pay your tickets and serve your detentions or you won't be going to the dance. And we'll be back with more LMTV news right after this. LMTV. TV, your school, your news. Welcome back. Student Council is selling specially made bracelets with all proceeds going to the Selena Apodaca and Bella Severson Memorial Scholarship Fund. Anyone can buy a bracelet for just $1. There are additional openings for the PSAT, which will be given one week from today. The PSAT is a practice, coll practice college placement test for sophomores and juniors. Sign up for the PSAT by paying $15 at the cashier's window. And that's a look at our top stories at this hour. I'm Kyle with Lamar Sports. There are no games, meets, or matches today. On the scoreboard, girls swimming took two from Wash. Varsity won 106-79. JV also won 100-60. And volleyball came up short to Kennedy 3-2. In other sports news, Powderpuff teams, your team shirts are available in the 11-12 office. Remember, you must watch the Ed Puzzle video before you receive your shirt. If you need a new QR slip, pick one up in the 1112 office. That's sports. Say Alec and Ariana back to you. Thanks, Kyle. In news from the counselors, a representative from Univista University will be in the College and Career Center tomorrow morning at 9. Get a pass in the 1112 office and stop by for a visit. Now here's Jacob with the Arts and Clubs. On the Arts and Clubs scene, there's a thespian meeting today at 3.30 in Mrs. Smith's room. Please see Mrs. Smith or the officers if you have any questions. Next Monday from 8.30 to 10, a representative from Milwaukee Institute of Art and Design will be in room D125B to give a presentation on their program offerings. FCA, Fellowship of Christian Athletes, meets tomorrow and every Thursday from 7.50 to 8.20 in the Ox Gym. All students and staff are welcome. That's Arts and Clubs. Alec and Ariana, back to you. Thanks, Jacob. For lunch downstairs, it's French toast sticks. The other line will offer the salad bar. Upstairs in the food court, it's the amazing pasta bar. Your LMTV forecast calls for partly cloudy skies today with a high of 70. Tomorrow looks like a chance of more rain with a high of 68. And we'll see even more rain on Friday with a high of 59. That wraps up today's edition of LMTV News. Remember, LMTV is always available online. Just go to the Linmar website or follow us on Twitter. Join us again tomorrow. And have a great day, Linmar.